my name is Adrian, and right now um, I'm a concept design engineer at Hela, which is uh, an international automotive supplier. I took the postgraduate program in design. Inside of there, it has many different programs. I can recall exactly the names, but they teach you how to use CATIA, how to do sheet metal in NX, how to do plastic design in CATIA, how to do surfacing in SOLIDWORKS, among others. I think I just stumbled upon the website. Uh, I chose you because of the projects, because mainly at the time I was looking for um, for projects for my portfolio because I will just graduated and I only had a couple. So I wanted something impressive so that uh, my employers could look at, the, at it and and be like, well, okay, this guy knows what he's doing. So, so I stumbled upon the website. I saw the projects that you guys had. I thought they were very industry relevant, not just something that you could look up in a YouTube tutorial, for example, it was way more complicated and involved than that. And that's, and I like that. So I, I chose that course. Before skilling, I didn't really have a career. I was looking for a job, but I was getting very uh, low offers. They either didn't pay very well, or they were just weren't really interesting projects, uh, mainly using SOLIDWORKS. Since I was learning CATIA, I decided to apply for, uh, for the job that I'm in right now, where they use CATIA for plastic design all the time. Since like three months until I, I got the job, I have been getting contacted by some uh, recruiters from other companies and people have been looking for me. So I would say getting getting this job in this company, uh, thanks to the courses that I got at Skilling, has been a very big boost to my career. Because nowadays I know what I'm doing and people or companies are looking for me. I'm not exactly sure of who I contacted at which times, but basically anytime I had a problem, there was someone, someone there to help me. Sometimes uh, there were problems, for example, technical issues when logging in, and basically I would raise a ticket and I would get a response within 24 hours, so that's great. It didn't happen often though, but anytime it happened, there was somebody that, there to help me. Uh, if I had some issues with the software, again, I, I could uh, get some help and they would help me. And I think I was, I was getting weekly uh, mentorship sessions um, where they asked how I was doing with the program, how, how I felt, anything they could be doing better, and also guiding me because uh, I could tell them what my goals were and they would tell me like, you know, maybe do this first, maybe do this second. And also anytime uh, I had a, I ran into problems while doing a project, they would help me out. Uh, they would see the issue right away and uh, they would help me fix it and so that I could continue learning. I actually recently got promoted about a month ago. Um, basically, a lot of CAD work in CATIA and a lot of surfacing. So, so basically what I did at Skilling was pretty much what I'm doing at my job right now, at least on one of the courses on the plastic automotive and design using CATIA. They teach you about tooling, about draft angles, about plastic properties, about surfacing in CATIA, about the uh, the tool making the A, A, A side of the plastic, the B surface, the C surface. So basically that's what I did all of the first year at my company. It was pretty much a one-to-one -one match. It's not really an issue, but I would say that sometimes since because of the time difference, um, I would have to, to make a session uh, uh, what do you call it? A support session at about 10 p.m., which for me it's okay because I was working on the morning, uh, anyways. I would say nine or ten. Um, I think on the course, some some uh, courses are more polished than others. For example, the Ultimate Solid course. Uh, it mm -hmm. seems that you guys have down have that very very polished. Uh, and there are some others where 
where maybe maybe I had some problems um, going through the through the different videos. I think in particular it was the NX course, I think. But but I didn't. It, it's really only a minor issue. Like um, at the end, I got some projects. I got the support. I learned what I came to learn, and it, it worked uh, all, out all the same. One thing that I will highlight, uh, probably a combination of the content and the support. Because it's very easy to, for example, look up some YouTube tutorial and try to do it. And if you run into an issue, well, you got to figure it out. And sometimes you cannot figure it out. So being uh, on a supportive system definitely helps, uh, helps a lot. And also the content, because it's very different doing something, some 20 minute YouTube tutorial, uh, rather than some several hours long project in skilling. The end result is very different. <laughs>